Hello guys, Zender55 here going to tell you how to install Fallout Online. Now if you're not sure what Fallout Online is, it's pretty much like Fallout 1 and 2 combined. Um, a lot of new features have been added in like a big giant Fallout MMO RPG kind of thing. It's, you know, pretty much an online Fallout 2 with Fallout 1 locations because they've been combined. But anyways, um, by the way, if you're like, why don't I just stick to number two or whatever, but this has uh, more features like uh, bases, uh, um, vehicles, and oh, real-time strategy, or I don't know. It adds a whole lot of stuff. You can... This. So this is the main website. Um, but yeah, this is, and it's free. Forgot to mention that. But uh, So I'm going to run you through how to download it. So this is the downloading client. We're just going to click on this page. So, if you already have the, you know, the game, you can get the compact, but I'm not going to run you through how to do that. Um, I'm going to get the full. Now, I already have this, so I'm not going to download but you just hit download, and it just pops up, and you'll start downloading. And it takes quite a bit for the full client, so just be aware of that. Especially, I have fiber up internet, so it, you know... It's a little faster for me, but if you have a bit of slower internet, it will take even more time. So just, you know, pick a day where you have some time. So what I did was, since I already had it installed, you pretty much just drag it down anywhere you want. But I just took this folder that I don't want to wait for the download, because again, it takes time, because I'm lazy, or impatient rather. And, uh, you know, so I just add it back into the RR. Now, usually this would say Fallout Online Reloaded Folder Full, but since I don't have that, we're going to go with this. So, you have to have WinRAR to essentially open this. It's called WinRAR Archiver. It's free. I'll have a link down below to some sort of WinRAR. I don't know if the link I'll provide is spam free or not because um, I'm just gonna go look for WinRAR. Usually you don't get things like even CNET nowadays, you can't get spam free. So just be careful when you're installing it so you don't get some spam. Be just don't hit, you gotta pick through it. Alright, so um, you know, you can pick a place to download it. Uh, uh, I usually I have it installed on my hard drive, but we're gonna pick another place. We're gonna pick my new hard drive I just installed. Uh, we're gonna name it game. You can just put this anywhere. You can put it on your desktop, um, but I'm just gonna put it on another hard drive because games run better on other hard drives. But for a game like this, I don't think I'll have a problem. So in the folder you have all this. Uh, this really is the insides. You don't even. All you have to do is inside the RAR. You just need to dr whatever folders inside of it. Just drag it out and let it extract. Just drag it out into the folder you want, whatever folder you want. And uh, let it go. And now, there you go, bam, you pretty much got it. So in here, how exactly do you launch the game and how, you know, all that stuff. Um, hmm. Now I'm just picking through the game. But, um, so there's two configs. I can't remember exactly which one was which. Uh, let me spool it through. Alright. So this is like key bindings, uh, name, color, colors. You know, just kind of small minor things. And then over here, we got more of the game configuration. Yeah, this is just like the Fallout 2 kind of window. You know. Yeah, you, you get the point. So there's two languages, Russian, I, I think. I don't know. I'm not familiar. English, you know, if you speak that, you know what I mean. Beep sound on uh, active game. Eh, a scroll delay. Uh, yeah. So like your resolution and stuff. Keep this. Don't don't mess with this at all. I would not touch that. So yeah, you can get your resolution and change it. For some, I I would like it to have widescreen, but it's just not with a Fallout um, engine that they are using in the time period, so it's gonna be standard. I mean, you could record it and then stretch it out, but I, I just don't like it. Uh, V-Sync, you can have always on top, um, you can stick the multi-sampling, uh, <clears throat> you can you can just, you know, do what, do what you want. Um, it's pretty 
It's a 2D game. You might see it on my channel. It, it's not hard to run, so. Um, yeah, oh, by the way, if you don't have Fallout 2, you just won't get any music. I think that was what it was. And, and that might be there, right? I don't know. I might be just making up things. So, when you're done, hit save. That all my stuff just closed down to. Alright. So, what do you launch to run this? Well, you launch the Fallout Online Launcher, and that's way too big. And she's going full screen. So, I'll just fix it because I actually have my launch full screen. And I don't want that for the purposes of this. So, we'll go down, launch it, and we'll lower full screen off, save. Alright. Alright, so what you get is this. Um, you have to register an account. So, you hit register, uh, you know, you take your name. Bob, you know, bong, boom, bong, bleh, your age, um, I tend to have my age like one, but, you know, my true age, but you know, oh, oh, I, oh yeah, I tend to be 14, um, you know, so yeah, the stats very do much matter, so just, you know, just saying, yeah, you should do a bit of research on what stats do what, I like bloody mess for no reason. And then when you're done, you hit done. Um, but you gotta set a password and all that. I'm not gonna do that. And, you know, when you wanna hit play, you hit play. Simple. And they added new loading graphics, I, think, I believe. But, yeah. They added new graphics, I believe. I think that was on the change logs. Or something. I don't know, I was just reading it and I'd just seen this. I don't remember this, so. We're gonna go with this. So now we're in the game. I believe I am at a friend's place, maybe. Uh, no, I don't think. And yeah, this is, you know, and then you're in the game, and then you can put up your boxes and stuff like that. So let me check my inventory. I have nothing. I am. I must have died. I don't know how I died. But yeah. Apparently I'm dead. Um, yeah, that's as far as I'll go for that. So, hope you enjoyed this, or well, it helped at least. I don't know if you enjoyed it. Uh, do you guys enjoy tutorials? It's beyond me. But yeah. So, uh, for any other, like, you want to submit tutor <laughs> tutorial ideas, just put it down in the in the, the comments description. What the hell? All the links, as always, will be down in the description just saying, and this is my custom background for my music channel uh, that's not related to anything, and I'll be uh, seeing ya, and I'm stalling again, look at this, this magical scene. We're gonna